I think my screen recorder just stopped recording but so again as I said create your strongest password so click this create new wallet now you could download the keystore file and it said don't lose it you can't recover if you lose oh that's the down downside of your uh, keystore file if you like format your laptop and forgot to get your keystore file then there's no way to get it so you must back up back up keep a backup or maybe uh create more copy on your desktop or i don't know just keep a backup of your keystore file so you could download your keystore file and you are required to download it so i think i will put it in wallet installer and save and then you will be allowed to continue and then you have your private key here if you want to you know uh, log into your private using your private key so save paper wallet same you should save it somewhere safe okay and then you could click your wallet info so you have here your select file type, provide password file. Okay, so this like this is the process thing. So go to account. So if you want to view your address, you can just view it. If you have uh, enter your password recently, so we will open our wallet here. So we should find that uh, this one, this file is a the file that is called keystore file then open and then you need to provide your password in order to view your account send and do transaction things uh, okay unlock <coughs> okay so this is your address so if you see this intersection it will only uh, view or display the transaction recently made and it is outgoing not when you send your Mintnik coin to this wallet but you could use Mintnik store for uh, transactions like uh, incoming transactions also uh, did you see the tokens in mintme.com? If you have trades like mine, like this EFCT coin, Corona coin extra, uh, Lilliput LC, but you need to have like deployed in, in blockchain, uh, blockchain and you can see this deposit and video. You can use that this to uh, store your tokens from mintme. So you could store here your tokens but also the good thing here about this uh, mint me wallet is your transaction fee could be very cheap like if you are in mintme.com you will have like 0.1 in here you will just use 0 0.0021 is the cheapest one or you could use the fastest one which is 0 0.008 
home wallet you have your network connected now in metamask this is the things you need to set up like a network thing so okay, let me open this one <coughs> so you need to set up your uh, network name uh, rpc url chain id symbol to use mint minute so in mint me or i mean in metamask you need to set up things and also i provided the Check out our 